Bahamian girl. Hi. Okay, yeah. the Bahamas is a nice, beautiful country. Yeah. There we get sun, sand, and sea. Greetings from the Bahamas. Welcome to Nassau, the capital city of the Bahamas. I'm excited to take you on an authentic journey beyond the typical tourist spots. I shall share my real and filtered first impressions and experience in this episode. <laughs> Pistol. Yeah. Pistol. 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 Give it up. Give it up. You want no, it? No, no, you, you, you want to try it? You try it first. Lord, I hear the meat. Uh huh. Oh, now the feet is getting hot. Uh huh. I need stomach so cold. Oh, oh. It takes some food. Ah, you say you don't step at all. More fire. More fire. I finish it. I shall also. Take you to the inner cities or what they call the low income areas here, interact with locals, and later on, we are going to experience nightlife here in the Bahamas. Are you excited? Well, if so, smash that like button and do not touch that dial. And let's get right into the episode. Well, we're down in the beautiful, beautiful 242 at the Commonwealth of the Bahamas. I'm your boy, Mario. All right? Mario. When you come down here, don't forget to try our delicious Kong salad. Yes. A nice fried snapper uh -huh. with some peas and rice and plantain and macaroni salad. Say your name is? Prince. I, I Are you from Trinidad? No, I'm not from Trinidad. Where are you from? Jamaica? No. Where? Kenya. Kenya? Yes. Ooh. The most beautiful women are in Kenya. I tell you that. No, seriously, no, not a joke. Yes, come. You married? If I'm married? Yeah. No, but I want to be. You want to be? Yes. You want to go to Kenya? Yes. Okay, take a ticket to go to Kenya, take, not take, me. Take, take, take. Yeah. Jamaican. You're Jamaican? Yeah, how, how's Bahamas for you coming from Jamaica? Hello. Everything, I like the food. The food? Uh-huh. Your favorite girls, food? Everything. Oh, you love Bahamian girls? Yeah, everything my love. Uh-huh. But yeah. <laughs> the Bahamian guys? Yeah? They tell you about the Bahamian guys? No, what, what, what should everything you know about? Everything is bigger and better. Everything is bigger and better. Bigger and yeah. better. Yeah. Real? What's real? Listen. <laughs> <laughs> does this, does it look fake to you? <laughs> That's real. <laughs> Made in Africa. Made, Made in Africa, Africa. Wow. the original. Original, but no, no BBL. Hey, All right. <laughs> are, you, are you from? Where you from? Africa. Kenya. Kenya. I don't know that. Yeah. All right. Okay. All right. Crazy. You offered me in your video too. Yes. You Hello. Me in your video. <laughs> <laughs> Huh? I saw, I know they're all looking at me. <laughs> because of what I have. <laughs> yeah. I have a marriage proposal. Bring closer. Let's see if they approve. He says yeah. we look good together. Don't we look good together, guys? Great. Come on now. Come on great. now. Yeah, look great Don't we look together. good together? We look great together. <laughs> Yeah, like so you gonna two young people, for real. two young people, uh -huh. ready to travel, the world. ready to travel the world. I see all the beautiful uh -huh. things in the world. Mm -hmm. I will bring you the moon and the stars. Mm -hmm. you, you do what? I will bring you the moon and the stars. Oh, you will bring me the moon and the stars. Yes. Oh, are you an astronaut? Moon. I will do. I will be an astronaut. Friend. You'll be my astronaut. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> the water is man this is bahamas baby welcome to the bahamas wow one two three four big cruise ships the name bahamas comes from the spanish term bahamar meaning shallow sea waters 
Tourism is the primary source of revenue, attracting around 8 million visitors annually, followed by offshore banking due to its status as a tax haven. The Bahamas is also known to be home of the popular late televangelist Miles Monroe. Many Hollywood celebrities have made the Bahamas their home, such as Beyonce and Jay-Z, who own two private islands, Oprah Winfrey, Eddie Murphy, who purchased a private island off the coast of Nassau worth 15 million US dollars. We also have Mariah Carey, Tiger Woods, and many more who have been drawn to this beautiful country. Geographically, it's the closest Caribbean island to the United States, the closest point being about 53 miles to Florida. walk through or drive through the streets of downtown Nassau, you can't help but notice the ancient buildings blending European influences with the Caribbean charm. There is various ways of touring the city, including ATVs and horses. So this is um, where you do the horse and buggy ride. They will give you a tour of downtown and the surrounding areas of Nassau. Oh, so someone can actually go? Downtown, sorry. Ah. Yes. So if you want to... So they would go on the streets? $15 each. $15? Per person. Per person? Yeah. Alright, so one of the ways of seeing Nassau. Well, Nassau is it's actually the capital, so it's it's really it's fast paced. Yeah. Fast paced. Uh, <laughs> I, I would She's consider her, so. <laughs> yeah, I would consider it being fast paced because the the family islands, yeah. Luther, where I'm okay. from, yeah. it's it's not it's not the same. It's it's totally different. Uh -huh. So we consider Nassau uh -huh. fast pace. This okay, go sure. Have, okay, Gombay Bahamas. We have a festival that is called uh, Gombay Festival. Yeah. And this is our slogan: It's better in the Bahamas. It's better in the Bahamas. So you'll see that everywhere. Yeah. Basically, everywhere you go, yeah. you would see that it is better in the Bahamas. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, this 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 chart, uh, Bahamas and Hawaii, the tropical print. Our first stop is going to be at the straw market, but as we are heading there, we saw this big crew of people dressed in pink and they had come on the cruise celebrating someone's birthday. Nice if, they could, if I could know who the birthday girl is. Happy birthday! Hello! Thank you! Did you come here for your birthday? I did. Oh, with the Oh, yes, my whole here. family. We're where so much fun. Where are you from? Tampa, Florida. All right, Tampa. Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> Our uh, famous straw market uh -huh. where all the tourists come to buy their souvenirs yeah. and their straw works and everything. Yeah. Plug it in. Oh my goodness, it looks so colorful, vibrant. I'm definitely getting something here. Yeah, and yeah. everything is indoor. We, yeah. don't, we don't have any outdoor stalls. So this is the market you don't this have? This is this is the market so where you is there some is it also the same market that they would sell food? No. You won't find food here, but there are a lot of restaurants along the the strip. Uh -huh. So you can find food everywhere. Alright, so yeah. let's get in and see what you can get. Souvenirs from Nassau. 
Just paid only in Nassau with your credit card in the market. Still here at the straw market, they have a section where they do wood carving. And one thing I know about wood carving, a lot of times it represents the culture of the people. I think that is the blue marlin, the national fish. Oh, blue? It's blue marlin. Blue marlin, the national fish of the Bahamas. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm good, I'm good. Maybe you can tell us a little bit about your work and what it represents. Well, and your name, your name. My name is JR. JR. Yeah. How long you've been doing this? I've been doing wood carving for 50 years. 50? 50 years. This year I can make 51. I started carving on the 18th of June, 1973. Wow. So this year I'll make 51 wow. years. Wow, wow, lovely. So you can tell us a little bit about your work and maybe what it represents? Well, like I say, right now, the last piece of carbon I just finished working on is that Nassau group here. When I complete it, yeah. it'll be like one of those in there. Oh, it's like those big fish. Yes. Uh -huh. when, 50 years ago when I learned the carb, the first thing I learned to make was a face like that. Ah, uh-huh. But now, we make it with the tourist one. What's the other you want? Once you're willing to pay the price, you get it made. Uh -huh. Is this part of the Bahamian culture? Yeah, we call okay. That's a junk, a junk no couple. Oh. Yeah, we call the man Bahama Papa. We call the woman the Bahama Mama. Oh, okay, all right. And of course, we got a lot of representation of the Bahamas, the tropical paradise. Yeah. The turtle, uh, turtles, turtles, turtles. Yeah. I see. We have a crab. We have lobster. Lovely, lovely. And uh, if someone wanted to get in touch with you on order, where can they get you? That's the number, that's my store, 456. At the straw market. Downtown straw market, 456 JR. What's your favorite thing about Bahamas? I want to trade the Bahamas, but no place in the world. You know why? Why? They got sunshine, the beautifulest beach in the world. From space, the guy said the beautifulest beach he ever saw us in the Bahamas. Uh -huh. So I don't have to shovel snow. You understand that's a way with tornado. Mm -hmm. But a hurricane, I don't use the hurricane. If a hurricane comes, you buy some food, you buy some liquor, and log down till the hurricane pass. Ah, awesome, awesome. Thank you so much, I You're appreciate it. Right. Uh, so we're coming from the straw market. We want to have a little tour of the dock. You call it the dock? Port. The port. Oh, port of... Oh, Port of Nassau. Oh, we, we're going through that side. Yeah. Oh. But basically, on, on any given day, there's yeah. basically three, anywhere from three to five ships. Yeah. Um, dock at the port. So it's, it's busy. Basically, we have a lot of tourists walking around, uh -huh. just enjoying the, the sunshine. Yeah, so. Yeah. I love how clean it is. Like you can see up to the very bottom. Let's take a tour around the port of Nassau. We normally have about 8 million tourists annually. Yes. 8 million? 8 million, yeah. So the Probably is the, uh -huh. one of the most popular tourist destinations uh -huh. in the world. 
welcome to west marina let's see let's see the directions here they say there's the arrivals terminal there's a museum welcome center marketplace and oh there's an amphitheater ground transportation taxis restaurants and west marina so this is where we are i love that they've just made it open and public that people can just come and walk you know yeah so this is the stage where locals perform yeah. on the weekends you can um, come and enjoy yourself uh -huh. yeah so we have all our local performers performers uh -huh. entertainers performing on the weekends I on friday uh -huh. i think it's happy hour uh -huh. i'm not sure if they're here on saturdays but i know for sure on friday on friday it's happy hour so this is where all the locals who's the most popular the musician our most popular one of musician. them one of them that comes to mind is kb uh -huh. yeah his name is kb what kind of songs what's the bohemian music our, our bohemian music is rake and scrape rick rake and scrape is uh -huh. is the bohemian music rake and scrape okay yeah. rake and scrape rake and scrape all right yeah. here i want to take some photo here the beauty of the location of the port of Nassau is the fact that it's not very far from the beach. You can actually walk to the beach. If you are on a cruise and you're having a small stop here, there is a beach nearby about 10 minutes and you will be at the beach. It's also very close to Paradise Island. It's walk. It's basically in downtown. So you can also enjoy restaurants and shopping around downtown Nassau. a pop of colors the blue is blowing the green is green the yellow is yellowing the orange is oranging if you don't want to leave the port you can still find a lot of shops here where you can do your shopping there's also restaurants and lots of other services that you can enjoy here there's also a taxi terminal where you can actually be able to order or request a taxi to take you to wherever you want in Nassau. Well, so still here at the port of Nassau, we have a museum of Jean the Japanese Japanese museum. It's a, it's a national festival that we have yeah. twice a year on New Year's, mm -hmm. New Year's Day and on Boxing Day. Okay. Yeah, so it is held on Bay Street. Uh -huh. Yeah, twice per year. All right, so let's check out the Bahamas Museum of John Cano. Oh, costumes. So this is what a typical costume looks like. I think it might be a fair piece or something. Oh, so there, there's John Cano characters. Yes. Oh. Yeah, so we normally have about maybe about 10 groups, 10, 15 groups. Uh -huh. um, some of them have about, maybe up to like 300 members. Yeah. Yeah, so they all perform with costumes. Okay. So from, unfortunately you cannot record, video record inside the museum of John Canoe but from it, next to it, as you can see, that is the entrance to the people who are on cruises. Well, so I'm back with my Bahamian gear and of course I had to dress down because I was feeling so hot. This place is extremely hot. So you can see I've had to dress down. Of course, I'm wearing my Bahamas t-shirt. Our next stop is going to be the popular Paradise Island. That is one place that a lot of tourists actually visit whenever they are in the Bahamas, especially in Nassau. We are going to check that out. So let's head to, let's head to the, what do you call it again? Paradise, Paradise Island. Island. 
So to access it, there's one bridge that goes in and one bridge that comes out, right? One of the most iconic structures of Paradise Island is the Atlantic Resort. And of course, when you Google or check out NASA, you're definitely going to see some photos of the Atlantis Resort. So we're going to just give you a little drive through here at the Paradise Island so you can have a glimpse of what it looks like. The real estate here at Paradise Island is also quite pricey. You know they call the Bahamas the rich man's playground. So let's drive where the rich people drive to as we admire the real estate. And there's also amazing, beautiful beaches here. There's a golf course, a top restaurant. So you can visit and enjoy some of that. So Sydney Point Point Sydney Point yeah. So Sydney Point yeah. He's a famous Bohemian and he's also a famous actor. Oh, from yeah. here. He's from the Bahamas, but he is. Mm -hmm. he's, so, he's deceased. Oh, it's two dollars. It's two dollars. Yeah. Okay, so this is what Bahamas money looks like. I did not start it, so this is one dollar. All right. Oh, so you pay toll fee to get in here. And the uh, airport, I should have mentioned this at the airport video coming in. The airport is named after the first president. First prime minister. First so prime minister, black prime minister of the Bahamas. What was the name? I can't pronounce it properly. So Lyndon Pinling. Lyndon Pinling. Lyndon yeah. Pinling. We are in Paradise Island. I want to buy a holiday home in Paradise Island. From my mouth to God's ears. <laughs> the playground of the rich and the celebrities. Janet Jackson is performing on the 27th. Yes. Here in at the Atlantis. Who knows? Maybe someone who's watching my videos stays around here and would give us a tour of Paradise Island. If you're watching my videos and you're from Paradise Island, I would love to visit your neighborhood. I love inspiration. I'm looking for inspiration and motivation. So invite me to Paradise Island and give me a tour around, you know. Show me one of the houses, the mansions, or maybe even if you're doing real estate, let's collaborate. Yeah, someone who's also in real estate, you can collaborate. Show us what you got here in the Bahamas, the apartments, you know, the buildings, the houses, you know. There is also a shopping center here at Paradise Island with a lot of beautiful homes. Sometimes if you want to clearly see these homes, you'll have to take a drive around the island. Not a drive actually, but take a boat and sail or go around the island or a kayak. You'll be able to see these beautiful homes with so many people who have packed their boats and yachts. that people will quickly point out to you here is the Michael Jackson suite that connects two towers of the Atlantis. So the bridge that connects the two towers. And you know what? It goes for 25,000 US dollars per night with a minimum of four nights. So if you want to spend time here, you have to have at least 100,000 US dollars because you can do a minimum of four nights. 
Our next stop is a place that's quite popular with the local Bahamian. So this is where you're going to find them on weekends or on holidays where they can just come get some funk salad as well as hang out with their friends. But uh, while at it, I want to show you where you can also get uh, domestic ships to take you to other family islands and even out of the country. The name of the club is Dog. Oh, Koreski dog. Yeah, so you can get fresh fish home. Mm -hmm. You can get some fritters. You can get a calypso. Oh. oh, so this is where people take boats to other yeah, islands. So this is where they take freight for uh -huh. the family islands. Uh huh. This is the company that I work for. So when you call them family islands, and what do you call the other islands? We call them family islands. No, how do you call uh, Nassau? Well, do you call Nassau it tourist is, island? No, Nassau uh -huh. is an island, yeah. but it's actually, a, a, no, Providence is the island. Yeah. Nassau is the capital. Yeah. Yes. So, so the outer, we either call them outer islands or family islands. Uh -huh. So Elutra would be considered an outer island or family island. Andros, Abaco, Bimini. Mm -hmm. Yeah, are so they called family because they mostly they're yeah they are smaller and uh -huh. mostly everyone is related. Okay. Yeah, so that's okay. the reason why we call the them family, family islands. islands. Yes. All right. So this is where you can purchase your ticket. Oh, you want to travel to the family island? You want to travel to the resorts anymore? Yeah, you buy your ticket here. Yes. Uh huh. You know one thing, one interesting thing that I've noticed from this angle when I've just seen a glimpse of the, I've just seen a glimpse of the place where we were, mm -hmm. and it kind of reminded me of Netherlands as well, like the colorful houses and then boat park in front. It's kind of like Netherlands with the colorful houses. All right, so we're stopping. We're going to check out. Hello, Hi, hello how are you? We're gonna check out how they're making conch salad which is a very, very popular delicacy here in Bahamas. Bahamas is also known for conch, and I'm told they even they export it, right? Yes, we do export it. Yes. Uh -huh. To what countries? We export it to China, the uh -huh. US, uh -huh. yeah, all over the world, basically. Yeah. yeah, I can see so many conch shells here. People use them for decoration. The conch, yeah, you can yeah. make jewelry. You yeah, can do a lot with the, it. Yes. Yeah, they make, but some people, because you have plenty of them, you throw in some yes. places, in some countries, that is really sold expensive. Mm -hmm. So it's just under the bridge coming from the Paradise Island. That's how you get these shops. Yeah, this is called the Potter's Key Dog. Potter's? Potter's Key. Potter's, oh, Potter's Key. Yeah, they keep them in the shelf until they're ready for them. Uh -huh. Yeah, so they're kept in the shelf until okay. they're ready for them. As customers order them, yeah. they take them out of the shelf. Hello. Can I see how you're preparing? Yeah. Okay. You ready for the camera? Huh? You ready? Yes, I'm ready. Hold on, are you, are you, are you showing? Are you got to knock on the one? Uh-huh. Take a picture of it. Okay, so this, this is what this, it looks like when it's in the shell. This is, come on, this is, when it comes on, this is slow. Yeah. This is a few juice mark right here. What's that? Female. Any name we oh, see the female. company that? Uh -huh. That's a female. Oh. This, this is a sign by... Yeah. Okay. You want a fish salad? Yeah, I want one, but you should. Try one. Have you tried one? I tried one. You want a pistol? You should. You, you wanna? Try you wanna try one? Yeah, I'm going to. Okay. You have a Are you from it? here? Yeah, I'm from here. Oh, yeah. right. I wanna try it too. Oh, you wanna try you the pistol? Yeah. Oh. I grew up on the island, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I had a few more. I mean, it's been a minute. Oh.
see that? Oh. See this right there? Yeah. It's, the yeah. thong actually is be on this, on the, on the same round thing. You gotta jig, jig it, release it off here. Yeah. Then pull it out. Okay. Oh. Pull that white thing out. So that's the pistol. Yeah. Pistol. Pistol. Oh, give it down. Give it down. You want no, it? No, no. You, you, you want to try it? You try it first. <laughs> Good. What does it taste like? It's kind of so it's crunchy it and it's salty. Yeah. Is it like that intestine? No. Uh -huh. okay. so try, that, try it. No. No, it's not. No, it's not. So is that the male one or female one? Another female. Oh, another female. <laughs> No, she's gonna try. Let her try it. No, you need to try it. <laughs> you know, you know, I'm on diet, right? No, that's not gonna do anything okay. to you. You try it. <laughs> they said it's good for the male. I don't know. <laughs> it's actually a ball of enzymes. Huh? It's actually just like a ball of enzymes. Yeah. But um, in like culture, they yeah. call it an aphrodisiac. Okay. It's just enzymes, and it tastes like I like to call it a salt water gummy worm. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so people believe yeah. it's an You're right. aphrodisiac. It's like a salt, yeah, like, like worm, a salt right? water yeah. gummy mm. gummy worm. So if you if someone takes too many of this, so poor. But I think Fuck you should. I think oh. you should. Yeah, I think you should ask. You should ask the man. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> They'll give you a good explanation. They'll tell you. <laughs> so this is eh? That's the pistol. Yeah. Anytime you see the black thing there, yeah. the brown bit is the meal. Oh, so this is the male? Yeah, the male. Okay. So that's the, the it's male. called the verge. The man, the man come. Okay, alright. Anytime so you see anything like that, you come yeah, so the, the man. The what is the so where's the pistol? Alright, it probably didn't come off. Oh, there you go. Okay, you That's for it. you? No, no you, you, are you, you not going to try it? Okay. I, don't, I don't eat nail. Is, is that it? Cedar, That's not cedar, it. Where? Right here. Cedar. Is that in it? Oh, I see it. It's right here. It's clear. Ooh, All right, gotcha. Yes, that's oh, a nice yes. juicy one. Oh, oh. <laughs> How does it taste? Amazing. Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know, for me, I don't eat snails. We don't eat snails in Kenya. <laughs> really? No, we don't eat snails oh, at wow. all. So because it's coming from a snail, that's why I can't tell. Oh, okay. Yeah. okay. <laughs> all right, all right. So okay, we can go to the other place. I'm not gonna have the salad because it's basically. Let me show them what the salad looks like. You got some salad? Yeah. Let me see. Let me show them what salad what salad mm. looks like. Oh, nice. Let me see. You want me to tie it? Or I don't want me to tie it. This is like ceviche salad, in Mexico. Uh -huh. It's similar to like ceviche. Mm -hmm. It smells, it smells good. It has some pepper. Yeah, it tastes really nice. Uh -huh. yeah. Oh shoot, see him leave it. Hey. So this has, is this the most popular dish in Bahamas? Seafood. Anything seafood. Anything is seafood. Very All right. And a little bit more salt for me. No less. All right. Yeah, but it's something that Bahamians normally do on the weekends. Like, okay. So, what can you tell the world about Bahamas? Um, oh, and your name, please? Uh, so, my name is Antoinette. Yeah. Um, I'm actually a journalist in the Bahamas. It is actually a very diverse place, a very unique place as well. Yeah. Uh, our dialect is like, like we have words that you won't find anywhere else in the world. We're so unique. The colors. I love the way, my favorite part of the Bahamas is the way the sky is blended to sea because like it's just oh, so yeah, beautiful, yeah. so gorgeous, so blue. Yeah. I don't know, it's just, I don't know. So there's a lot of things to love about the Bahamas. Oh, you're a journalist? Yeah. Oh, it's print, media, or? Broadcast. Ooh, we're still out and about in Nassau. Nassau. What's the name of this area? This is Fort Montague. Fort Montague. Fort Montague. Yes. Okay, Fort Montague. Yeah. So we normally have like national regatters. What's regatters? It's a like it's a festival. It's uh -huh. where we have um, 
sail in both competitions. All right. And stuff like that, yeah. All right. Fort Montague. Yeah. Fort Montague. Yes, sir. Absolutely. Seafood market. Yeah. Seafood market. You want to have some fish today? We're oh, just checking around. No, I'm not going to cook. No cook. Oh, I'm not going to cook. I'm just checking around to see what they have. Where are you from, baby? <laughs> it's so beautiful. Man. <laughs> oh my God. Where are you from? I can't, I can't, I'm from Nassau. I can't make you my impression. <laughs> I want to make you my impression. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, look at that. <laughs> oh, let's see. He says he wants to make me his empress. Oh. I want to make her my wife. He wants to make me his wife. How many do you have? I only have one wife. So you want two? What fish is which fish is this? This is the Nassau grouper. Nassau grouper? Yeah. And like, this, this oh. is not a snapper. That's my favorite. I love snapper. No, this is not snapper. Oh, you ain't gonna walk. You ain't gonna walk. No, we sell them at the side. Okay. The scalp? Where's the snapper? Something impressive about this fish market is the fact that it's actually very clean and it has no stench, which is quite rare to find. Uh, across the world, in most fish markets, you know that smell that's always popular there. I loved how they keep it clean here. All right, all right. African tigress on YouTube. Okay. Yes. Jamaica. You're Jamaican? Oh, how long have you lived in Bahamas? I just came from Jamaica yesterday. Yesterday? Yeah. In the Bahamas, three months now. Three months now. Oh, how do you love it? Yeah, how do you find Bahamas? Oh, I'm find it. Yeah, how, how's Bahamas for you coming from Jamaica? Oh, nice. You love it here? Yeah, I love it. Oh. You want to stay longer here? Yeah. yeah. What, what do you love about Bahamas? I love everything. I like the food. The food? Uh-huh. Your favorite girls, food? Everything. Oh, you love Bahamian girls? Yeah, everything my love. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, okay, all right, all right. No, I want you to tell us what's one thing that you love about the Bahamas. Oh, I love being around the sea, the seafood, and being around the beaches. And do you know where I am from? You from Nigeria? I'm not from Nigeria. Where are you from? Kenya. Kenya. What do you know about Kenya? Not much. I know that. Huh? Some part of Africa. Some part of Africa? Yeah, that's it. And what do you know about Africa? My empress over there. I huh? My empress there. Your empress is in Africa? Yes. No, she's here now. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not me. <laughs> she's here now. I use my empress now. No. I will love to cherish you and love you for the rest of the days of my life. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I want to cook clean and give you full body massage every day. <laughs> every, I'm telling you, and I have a tenant. Uh -huh. You can cook clean and give me... Listen, I have a marriage proposal here now. Yes. I have a marriage proposal. Bring clothes and let's see if they approve. He says yes. we look good together. Don't we look good together, guys? <laughs> Great. Come on now, come on great. now. Yeah, I look great. Oh, we together. look good together. We look great together. Yeah, like so for real. You gonna two young people. For real. Two young people. Uh -huh. Ready to travel Love the world. To travel. Ready to travel the world. I see all the beautiful this, things uh -huh. in the world. Mm -hmm. yeah. I will bring you the moon and the stars. Mm -hmm. you, you do what? I will bring you the moon and the stars. Oh, you will bring me the moon and the stars? Yes. Oh, are you an astronaut? I will do, I will be an astronaut. You will be my astronaut. <laughs> 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 You're gonna be my astronaut. <laughs> I will be your astronaut. Uh -huh. I will give you full body massage, cook and clean for you every day. Uh -huh. And where will you take me to travel? You say you travel a lot. We're gonna go all over the place. We wanna go to Jamaica next. I, come, I just came from Jamaica. Yeah? Yeah, I just came from Jamaica. Yeah, let's go Cuba. Okay, Cuba. Yeah. When? 
you go Are you ready? Week. Next week? Yeah, I'll go next week. Uh, okay, are you, you fully, ready now? Fully paid. I'm ready right now. Fully ready ready right now. Yeah, fully paid. Fully paid. <laughs> you're flirting so hard. <laughs> and you already have a wife, so he wants two wives now. Yes, I have a mother now. Hmm? Yeah, my wife is a mother. Your wife is Muslim. Yeah. Oh, what's your name? My name is Twai. Twai, then you are... Twai Muhammad. I'll see you. No, no, I don't live. I'm not leaving you. I actually, let me see. This is my uh, Bahamas outfit. Yeah. I changed. I went and changed. How is it? You look nice. You look like Bahamas. Welcome to Bahamas, baby. This is Bahamas. You look like Bahama Mama. I look like Bahama Mama. Yeah. And you look like Bahama Papa. Mama. Ooh, this is your Bahama Mama here. I love it. <laughs> I want to take a photo. Rafiki, welcome to the Bahamas. <laughs> if you're not in the Bahamas, you're missing out. It's better in the Bahamas. Just exploring, continuing with the uh, tour of Nassau. Of course, we're going to hop to other islands. And I can't wait to see life beyond the uh, popular Nassau. And now I know. In Kiswahili, we would read Nassau as Nassau. In Kiswahili, it would read Nassau, but it's actually Nassau. And I'm very sure a lot of Africans would read it as Nassau. Yeah. Yeah, so this is Montague Beach. Yeah. All of the beaches in the Bahamas are free. Anyone are welcome. The uh -huh. locals normally come on the weekends, hang out, and just mm -hmm. have a good time. So, yeah. This is just one of our beaches, one of the many beaches that one we have. One of the many. Yeah. And over there, that's the oh, those, beautiful yeah. houses you saw in Paradise Island. Yeah, that is also Paradise Island. Huh? And uh -huh. the water is clear, very clear. Yeah. You can actually see the bottom of Yeah, the you ocean. can see the bottom of the ocean. We're gonna swim someday, not now. Yeah. yeah. Just look at how clear the water is. This is exactly what I was seeing. I even saw fish swimming from the plane. Yeah. You want, you want to talk to me about something? Yes. Sorry, Let's go. I, what, what should I, I know to, about I Bahamas? To, yeah. Well, I can tell you one thing I should know about the Bahamas. The Bahamas is a beautiful place to be. Yeah. It's a nice place in the world. And the, mm -hmm. well, like I said, the archipelago yeah. of the Atlantic Ocean to come to. Yeah. Sun, sea, and sun, and friendly people. Public hospital, Princess Margaret, free? Yes. Is healthcare free in the Bahamas? Yeah, basically it is. We have national health insurance, so yeah. basically yes. What about education? Education is free as well. Yeah, you can attend um, the University of the Bahamas. How many? Once you meet the requirements, uh -huh. then yes, you can go for free. How many? No student loan to pay later? No. Oh, really? No. Nice, nice. So how many universities do you have? Just the University of the Bahamas. We have two campuses. Yeah. One in Nassau and one on Grand Bahama. Ah, but okay. we also have the University of the West Indies. Oh, you also we? Also here in Nassau, yes. Ah, okay. all right all right all righty so we've made it to the is it called the queen's staircase yes. yeah we're going to tell you more about it once we see them all right all right guys so next we're going to be visiting the queen's staircase which is a very popular touristic destination here as well in Nassau. so come with me Let's go see the Queen's staircase. Okay, yes, this is the Queen's staircase, also known as the 66 steps. It was carved from limestone rocks by slaves in the late 1700s. 17, 
1793, between mm -hmm. 1793 and 1794. Yeah, oh, so, yeah. Yes. Okay, so let's check the 66 steps. Maybe hold this for me. I want to confirm that I'm actually going to walk 66. One, two, three, four. Remember I that think the one, one was covered like during construction or something, so it might be 65. 65. So actually, but it's basically 60, it should have been 66. And actually, they were handmade, right? Yeah. They so were. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm at 24 now. So, so they have this beautiful water fountain here, just next to the chair. So it continues. 25, 26, and 17, and that is it. Yeah, so it's been up now. Welcome to the Queen's Staircase. I'm gonna tell you, I'm, you can find me on Facebook. I don't care, but I, I, I'm going to tell you the history of this. I live here. Okay. My this name is Shane Lane Williams. This is called the Queen's Staircase. Now, if you get a picture, make sure I get a picture of you all by the Queen's Staircase. I can tell you what it's all about, and uh -huh. I can tell you everything that you need to know. I'm a tall guy, but this is what I do. And welcome to the Queen's Staircase. Okay. What you see here is not Mother Nature. This used to be one big solid rock. 600 slaves in 16 years, Brahma chiseled from West Africa, coffee out. Men, women, and children, no coffee break. This is carbo because it's used as an escape passage. If the fort up there where the cannibals were attacked, they would come straight down and come through that cave in there. Right by that picture from Oh, that's yeah, a cave. that was a cave, yeah. All right, listen good. They closed it up because too many people want to explore it. Now, this is one big solid rock. This is used as an escape passage. 600 slaves from West Africa, men, women, and children. They will hop straight, go straight and hop on a boat and get away. Now on this side is a man-made waterfall. It just cut it on yesterday. That the beautified the Queen's staircase. That was put in the Independence Day, July 10, 1973. It's on now, so we could get a good picture of that. Now if we go up here, so these are where the native people in the Bahamas live. These are over the hills. The people who wake on Pirate Ace Island gotta come over the bridge to get home. Go up here and come see the whole entire Nassau. Come, let me show you all something. <laughs> I, got, I get two more people. Hello. Hello, ladies. Hello, how you doing? Oh, country trees. You got the ball, the beautiful, or the young, or the rest is. Oh, the cruises are living. Now, the rocks will come with the queen staircase. They build this fort. Oh, OK. It looks like a boat, but this so boat So these are move. some of the curio shops that you find here. Oh, so this the is the you, fort. This is the yeah. fort. This is the fort right here. Uh-huh. Fort Finn Castle. Fort Finn Castle. This is a fort that looks like a boat, but this boat don't move. The this rock, boat don't move. This, 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 the, the rocks will come over the Queen's staircase where they, where they carved that out. They used it to build this fort. Oh, tremendous. They open, they open 8 o'clock in the morning, $3 for the head, and the body go free. Oh, the head, the head is $3, the body is free. $3 okay. for the head, and the body go free. So I can cut the head and just send the body. Yeah, right. Well, that's what they say. Come on. Oh, so you can see some history. This here, get a picture of this. When it was built, you get a picture of that, then you can, you know what, where you are. Okay. If you want to see information about Fort King Castle, there it like is. Hey, can't say this. When I'm locked up, they won't let me out. When I'm locked up, they, they won't, won't let, let me out. out. When I'm no. locked up. Hey, can <laughs> Inch and a bench. Uh huh. Oh Lord, an enemy. Uh huh. Oh, now the street is getting hot. Uh huh. And they used to mark so cold. Oh, oh. You take some food from the pot. You do anything to fill that gap. Woo, driver. That makes the spice. Driver. Don't stop at all. Driver. driver. Don't even touch. So make a little run and come back quick. Driver! You say you don't stop at all. More fire. More fire. Watch your eye finish yet. You stop your bangles. Buy your slave. 
You can do it all by yourself. Let me see you do it. I got hey. one song I'm dancing Let me see you do it. Hey. hey, 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 thank you. I'm loving this. Thank you. You get guys. My you name is Shane Lionel Williams. Shane Williams, what's this that you've been talking? What's this? Water. This is water. Drink some. This is water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank Agua. you. Agua. Agua. Thank you, baby. Yeah, <laughs> you say yes, baby. <laughs> All right. Water keep your kidney flowing. Oh, it keeps Now, I keep your kidney flowing. Okay. I may be 60 years old, but I can dance and I will make you dance. I'll dance to make you dance. You'll dance to make, make me dance. dance. I'll dance listen, to make you dance. I tell you something you believe this. My son is 42, I got another one 32. I got six granddaughters saying, Grandpa, I don't like to be called Grandpa. Because uh -huh. I might be 60, but I said, stroking to the east and stroking to the west. I'm stroking to the woman that I love the best. I'll be stroking. That's Clarence Carter. That's who sing that song. All right, thank you so much. Thank and you. And I don't know where you're going to go this way or you're going to go away. This way because I got to go tell, go tell you another thing. A man going up there on that water tower, yeah. and he say, I believe I can fly. And he flew. I believe I, I can, can touch, touch the, the sky. sky. Think about it every night and day. Let my rings and fly away. I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. Tell you, you know the song too. Yeah, you put your own words in there. I didn't put my the man going up there, and believe me, he hit the ground quick and he could rinky eye. He didn't fly. Oh, he flew. He yeah. going to hell or he going to heaven? Hell. But when no one think God say so you take your own life, you know where you're going. Yeah. Cause you didn't give life, who will take your life? Yeah. He said, I believe I could fly. He didn't fly, cause he the head is a giddy. Oh. So welcome anyhow. But you see every some sunshine on a cloudy day. When you see it rains, it just pass over. All right, all right. We don't have much uh, sun and thing, I mean, much of rain and thing in the Bahamas. Uh -huh. But the hurricane is passed, so we'd be lucky. Ah, uh, okay. You all right. part of where you all come from? I come from Kenya. Kenya, man, you're 45,000 miles away from home. I'm 45 miles home. away from home. Away from home, away from, from home. home. Away Lord, from I'm 45,000 miles, miles away, away from home. home. Away from home. You know, you know, sing that song? I don't know. I'm just Sister singing. Sister Nancy. I don't know. I'm 45 miles. 45 Get the invitation million. to go America. You pack up your passport and your visa. Me book up. Me book up. I had to make up. So that you wear with a rotella. <laughs> oh, you are such a character. Thank you so much. Yeah, well, I, I hope to get a good video because my name is Sin Lionel Richie. For the ladies, I'm Lionel Richie, and I never scared. Oh, okay. It'll be all night long, <laughs> all night. Oh, yeah. For all the... night long, all, all night. night long. You better bring it, come back with your wife. Because she might come back. Hey. She so could be like Cinderella. She dropped the slippers, I'll pick it up. <laughs> I gotta go. How you all doing? <laughs> all right, let's go. Thank you. You so all come much. up the Queen's staircase. Anybody tell you what they're all about? Yeah, we know. All right. The view from here is so spectacular. Look at that. We can, can we go down by the So we left the Queen Staircase. We are now out of that area. We are out of downtown. Oh my goodness, that's a tiger there. Mm -hmm. ah, okay, unfortunately, it's too. We just passed it. I can't show you. I know my family. <laughs> yeah, so we're going to give you a glimpse of the other side of Nassau, which is like the inner cities, right? Yeah, so inner cities is what people would call ghetto, but these ghettos here, haha. <laughs> You wouldn't think it's ghetto. You wouldn't think it's ghetto. Basically, it's like really very nice, very organized. In some places, in some countries I've been to, this would be like middle class or even above middle class neighborhood. So let me turn the camera so that you can see what I'm talking about. Yeah, they're like because of areas. So these are the low income areas. Look at this. This is low income areas in Bahamas. 
you know Bahamas is the richest country in the Caribbean uh, apart from maybe the the overseas territories like of the countries that are independent countries this is the richest country in the Caribbean but of course we have some other islands that are rich but they are like British protectorate or American protectorate right yeah. so this is the richest country and these are inner cities Wow This is Bahamas Welcome to Bahamas baby Bahama mama welcomes you to Bahamas baby one thing that's very noticeable despite being a low income area is it's quite clean look at this it's very 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 clean love that so what are some of the high income areas apart from i know paradise island is high income yeah it would be more like the western part of the island that's close to the well, airport it depends. You, you can have some high income uh -huh. People living in the in the cities as well. But uh -huh. Yeah, I guess it's just a term. Yeah. But yes. So, we, so have sub, we call them subdivisions, uh -huh. like the middle class. Yeah. Then the upper, like the high end. Yeah. So basically, it's like there's no like real okay, real real ghettos, you know? No, we don't call them ghettos. Like I said, we call them inner, inner cities. cities. Inner cities or low-income areas low income areas yeah but this is what you would consider a I, ghetto okay yes. in other countries in other countries with yeah. proper roads and signages and very calm one thing i've noticed about the bahamas it's quiet yeah it's very quiet it's very quiet you can't see anybody else. lovely place lovely country beautiful place very beautiful trust me if you got money but you have to know you need money money like um i'm staying at a place that would probably be considered not considered like the cheapest place that i found in downtown is hundred dollars per night and i'll definitely show you i'm not so sure if this vi this video this clip will come before i give you the tour of the place or after but i'm definitely going to show you uh uh, the type of uh, accommodation that I got and that's hundred US dollars and that's the cheapest so if you want more luxury more comfort you might end up spending like even a thousand dollars a day like depending on the level of luxury but maybe decent let's say maybe like holiday in maybe three hundred dollars plus two hundred dollars maybe five hundred dollars expenses per day including transportation maybe your tours and depending on what you book the bahamas has one of the highest standards of education in the world and this is university of bahamas ub that attracts people from all over the world to just come and get education here in the bahamas you can see the sign university of bahamas look at that it looks so beautiful You'd think it's like a government office or, you know, something, something very well organized. This is the University of Bahamas, but we can't get in. But this is what it looks like on the outside. Alright, so one of the places that you should also check out when you are in Nassau is called fish fry So everything seafood you will find it here. So oh, I've been on diet <laughs> Mimi, you know, I've been on diet eating fruits and fruits But uh, Whenever I'm around red snapper, I can't help it so Oh, one uh, of the most okay. Oh, this is one of the most famous for seafood. I like it. Oh, thank you. I love yours too. Thank you. <laughs> so let me let me just give our people a glimpse of what it looks like. Yeah. So we're going to. <laughs> oh, inside you can over there. Yes. Well, so we're going to be eating here, but. 
I want to give you a little tour around the fish fry. I'm going to be having Goldie's conch house. Conch, conch house. I don't know why I keep saying calling it conch, but yeah. So, a little tour, walking tour of the fish fry, the popular fish fry. There's no way you're gonna visit Bahamas, especially in Aso, and fail to get to the fish fry area. So, basically, it's a number of all these colorful stores here, which are mostly restaurants selling. Oh Lord! Hey, these are mostly like. Uh, restaurants that are selling seafood. Greetings from the Bahamas. Greetings. Hello. How are you? Hope you're enjoying your stay. I love you it. Obviously, I love you're it. Trinidadian. I see that band. Oh, you see my. How that's many bands do you see? So okay, that's so you see this is Trinidad. Trinidad. Okay. Okay. What about the rest? Let me see. This one is Grenada. No. This is um no um South Africa. No. I'm trying to. Th well, this one is. Jamaican for sure. Okay, that's oh, I was get. I thought these colors were together. No, oh, this, no, no, no. this one is. It's an African country for sure, right? I don't know. I'm trying to remember. You got me on that one, but for sure, <laughs> Trinidad and Jamaican. I'm trying to remember which which one is that. Isn't that South Africa? No. No. Grenada. No. This one, this one, the lower one, black, white, red, white, green. Which one is that? I don't know. I'm thinking. You got me though. You need a Bahamian okay, one now many? though. Okay, give me a Bahamian one. I, I wish we had some. I don't even know who's selling the. Oh, I know there's a guy over there. He has nice bracelets and stuff too. To make your arm, you know, add your, to your accessories. Add more colors. Yeah, add more color. How many countries can you name in Africa? At this time? probably maybe just Nigeria but I, I've seen others on like the ground and stuff but at this time only Nigeria and that's the basic So only one. South Africa and Nigeria are the only countries you know? No, Africa is big. Yeah. I so know it's more countries but yeah. I can't. One time ago I could have told you. Now you, you got me. What happened? You got You me. don't lose knowledge as you grow. You increase no, knowledge. You increase knowledge. Yes, you're right. <laughs> yeah. You're right. And you're, you're from? Anyway, this is Kenya. Kenya. Ah. So you don't know Kenya? No, I, I know about I know, I know about I know Kenya, but I was trying to remember. What do you know about Kenya? They can run, run, run long. They run for sure, track. Yeah, track. yeah. I know they I know they go for track for sure. Yeah. Yeah, sure. R E S S. Yes. Got you. Is that your hairstyle? Nice, right? So this is what we call in the Bahamas a patch. A yeah, patch. so it's just a different way to, you know, you cut your hair, you leave a patch of hair. Some people have patches on the side and the back. So that's said you have long hair. Yeah. Yeah. So what's the significance of a patch? It's just a, a hairstyle. Oh. Just a hairstyle. So is yours also considered a patch? No, so this no. is, <laughs> I I think people will call this high top locks. High top locks? Yeah. Oh, do you turn? Let yeah. me see. Yeah. Oh, okay. So All it's right. just dreadlocks. I just have a fade. Or in the States, uh -huh. I think they would call it a taper. Come on, baby. Yeah. Taper. Yeah. We go away. Look good on back of the... We roll is man. I'm a feel the boy, man. We go. Where will you take me? We pop up and down. <laughs> I'm touring around here for now. So where are you from? Nigeria? I'm from Kenya. Kenya? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So where the lucky guy? Where the lucky guy? Yeah. Somewhere. Oh, so I guess I'm rich now. You're rich, why? I made it. I love your accent. You love my accent? It's so nice. Accent. What part of Kenya are you from? The capital. She says she's from Africa. I love that. That's nice. What do you know about you Africa? Nothing much. Do you want to marry me? Why are you, you asking me if I have kids? <laughs> I have no kids. No kids? Yeah, no kids. Wow, you're just like me. No so kids. you want? How many do you have? No kids. How many? Are you married? No married. You see my hand? I don't, see any I don't, ring? No, no I don't ring. trust that. <laughs> I don't trust that. <laughs> I'm single, single, single. Enjoy being single. They tell you about the Bahamian guys? Yeah? They tell you about the Bahamian guys? No, what, what, what should you know about? Everything is bigger and better. Everything is bigger and better. Bigger and yeah. better. Yeah. <laughs> Let me see you clearly from this side. Bitter. Bitter. Better. 
Everything is bigger and better. Bigger about, and better. About Bahamian guys. That's why Stella got a groove back. Pardon? That's why Stella got? Got a groove back, baby. In Bahamas. Yeah. All right. That's I didn't it. know that. <laughs> All right. Have a lovely evening. Enjoy. All right. Have a good one. Nice All meeting right. you. All right. Baby. Bye. Real? What's real? What's real? <laughs> Does this does it look fake to you? That's me. <laughs> Made in Africa. Made, Made in Africa. Africa. Wow. The original. Original. What? No, no BBL. No. No, no DR. No Mexico. Yeah, I'm missing. No. Ah, ah, no. No I'm surgery. Not, no surgery. Real party. That's real party. Please continue. Place. You're going to fall off your bike if you don't. No, baby. <laughs> I'm going to crash. <laughs> Don't crash, please. <laughs> no, only if you walk close to the road, you're going to make me crash. Okay, I'm not going to walk close to the road, okay? All right. Have a good one. Nice meeting you. Bye. All right. Pleasure. All right, make sure you subscribe. Take care. All right. Find me on the festival. All right. <laughs> Where are you from, I mean? Where are you from? Okay. Kenya. Kenya. I don't know that. Yeah. Alright. Okay. Alright. Crazy. You want to put me in your video too? Yes. You Hello. You want to put me in your video? <laughs> <laughs> Huh? I saw, I know they're all looking at me. <laughs> because of what I have. <laughs> but so many of that here every day. You know, having been here, spent some time here, I think Bahamas is nice to see it just beyond the cruise, you know to stay back, enjoy your nightlife because with the cruise you only have like 8 to 5 p.m. and that is it. But I think it's really lovely to stay here and experience life after 5 p.m. because after 5 p.m. most of the cruises are gone. Downtown is closed but places like Fish Fry right here, they'll still be, hello, they'll still be open. All the people who had rented the jet ski companies they taking back their jet skis. All these were by the dock, and the tourists were coming to enjoy. It's better in the Bahamas. No, I don't know how to. Somebody can go with you. No, not today. Tomorrow. Yes, tomorrow. Yes, tell us. Well, we're down in the beautiful, beautiful 242 at the Commonwealth of the Bahamas. I'm your boy Mario. Alright? When you come down here, don't forget to try our delicious Kong salad. Yes. A nice fried snapper uh -huh. with some peas and rice and plantain and macaroni salad. All right. And don't forget to come down and get your shave from the barber shop. Come right down on this walkway. Yes. And it will take you to the wonderful brick road of the beautiful fish rack. All right. All Welcome right. Welcome to the Bahamas. Thank you so much. You say your name is? Prince. I, I Are you from Trinidad? That. No, I'm not from Trinidad. Where are you from? Jamaica? No. Where? Kenya. Kenya? Yes. Ooh, the most beautiful women are in Kenya. I tell you that. No, seriously, no, not a joke. <laughs> they always say the most beautiful women come from Africa, the motherland. Oh yes, come. You married? If I'm married? Yeah. No, but I want to be. You want to be? Yes. You want to go to Kenya? Yes. Okay, take a ticket to go to Kenya, take, not take, me. Take, 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 take me and don't bring me back to the <laughs> What's your name? Uh, my name is Lynn African Tigress on YouTube. Okay, okay, yes. okay. Yes. So how can I find the channel? So go on YouTube and search African Tigress. African Tigers. Tigress. T I G. Tigress, like female yes. tiger? Yes, yes. Okay, yes. okay, okay, You'll I can find, find that. On YouTube. Okay, okay, all right. All right. You're gonna Welcome be to the famous. Bahamas. You're gonna be famous. Okay, <laughs> Welcome to the Bahamas. Welcome to the Bahamas. Two, oh, it's two, four, two. Yes, all right, nice. bye. <laughs> oh, vibes on vibes. Welcome to two, four, two, the Bahamas. You see the cruise ships have left. There's only one that's about to leave right now. 
So this is the popular Jun Kanu Beach. Let's keep exploring the Bahamas. I love, love, love it here. If you love jerk chicken, they also serve that here. Let me go. I'm going to come back through the beach side. Hello. Hi. You making jerk chicken? We have jerk chicken. Oh, that's what you're making in yes. this? Oh, nice. You're so beautiful. Are you from here? Yes, I'm from here. Oh, nice. I'm from Kenya. Okay. Yeah. What can you tell the world about Bahamas? All of my but of course, beautiful Bahamian girl. Hi. Okay, yeah. the Bahamas is a nice, beautiful country. Yeah. Where we get sun, sand, and sea. Uh huh. Come on down and visit it. All right. <laughs> Thank you. And what's your name? Stacia. Stacia. Yeah. Oh, nice meeting you, Stacia. Oh, I see it. Stacia, go check out African Tigress on YouTube. African tigress, like a female tiger. Okay. All right, thank you. Welcome. All right. <laughs> oh, nice. So, I just want to give you a glimpse of one of the popular beaches, the June Canoe Beach, here in the Bahamas. And actually this is like the edge, this is the north side of the, the island, Bahamas, New Providence, I think, like the edge of this particular island. So I'm not going to go all the way, but yeah, you'll have a glimpse of what the beach here in the Bahamas looks like. Oh, the carnival uh, cruise ship is also living. So all the five cruise ships have left. Hello. Hi. Well, well, the sun is about to set. I want to go back to where we were eating or where we're going to eat. I don't know if I should, but maybe a snapper won't hurt. Snapper is protein, so I might try that. But I'm going to work out way more after that. <laughs> I love this healthy eating and workout part that I am in. So. This is where the people actually rent the jet skis. You can see plenty of them here. Greetings, good people, and welcome to Bahamas. I'm about to, oh, okay, I need to look there. Not looking at myself through here. Okay, so I'm about to step out for nightlife in Bahamas and I want to bring you on that experience. Oh my goodness, it's been long since I did a nightlife video. But today, today, we're going to be experiencing nightlife in Bahamas. This is the outfit of the night. I wish I, wish I had a full mirror. I did a room tour. I think I'll attach it. This room is so small, but so, so expensive. Anyway, so this is my outfit. Outfit of the night. Yeah! <laughs> and of course, with a nice shoe to go with it. Maybe when my friend comes to pick me, uh, they're going to, you know, do a little outfit check. So, super excited and let's step out for nightlife in the Bahamas, in the most expensive country. In the Caribbean and also among the most expensive countries in the world. So this is the east side. Yes. It's not 
far from Brownton? No. You'd think it's far. Because <laughs> you say east, west, north. Yeah. So our first stop of the night. Oh my friend here. Hi. Hi. What's your name? Danielle. With Danielle here. <laughs> this is gonna be our first stop, Waterloo. Yeah. On the east side. East side. Yes. So what kind of place is this? So this is a restaurant uh -huh. slash bar nightclub it transforms in the night so it's a in the during the day it's a restaurant yeah during the night it's a club slash bar mm -hmm. whatever local tourist yes both both yeah all right on the east side of narso new providence yeah I should say it new providence. Like they're having an event across yeah, there's an event across the street. We can find out. <laughs> Let's check here. Maybe we're at the wrong place. <laughs> so it's called Waterloo. Waterloo. Yeah. Waterloo. <laughs> like in England. Yeah. Just like a soccer party across the road. We might just go over there. So let's see the Waterloo first. Okay. Get that contact girl. Yeah. So $10. <laughs> yes. Yeah. <laughs> entry fee. <laughs> Once you pay the entrance fee, they call it damages okay. and something. You'll be given a hostess who's going to take okay. you to where you're going to sit. Our hostess, and I can hear Afrobeat. <laughs> That's grandma. Ooh, Aria Star. We decided to go and see what's happening in the streets of downtown and also get to sample other places for nightlife. So let's head there. Let's go. Come with me. We've been driving around, singing songs way too loud because we wanna. Picking up a love friends, fill up the car to live because we wanna. We wanna. Yeah, we just wanna have fun. The trunk's full of. bar another spot unfortunately i really didn't get to film as much of the nightlife but we really did uh, hop from one place to another just to experience the nightlife different neighborhoods different classes or status of clubs and my goodness it was amazing it was amazing you definitely have to try this out and just ensure you go early some places close earlier but there's some places that go all night till morning thank you so much for watching this episode i hope you truly enjoyed it and you learned something new don't forget to hit the like button share and subscribe i always say sharing is caring go ahead and share this episode on your social on your whatsapp status on your instagram stories remember to tag me also 
post it on your facebook and any other social media platforms or groups that you are in i would truly truly appreciate that i'm on the road to 300,000 subscribers and i know we can get there let me know what you think in the comment section below did you enjoy it did you have fun did you learn something new let me know in the comment section below and i can't wait to share the next episode with you and until then bye bye kwaheri